Hello crafty friends, welcome to this video. This is something that I'm trying here, uh, it's a little unique, but I want to talk about this pattern that I have just completed. Um, it Right now the unofficial name of it is called the Mountain Forager Shrug. So as a little backstory, over on my rumble.com ch uh, channel I was asked to design a shrug and this was back over the spring semester when I didn't have so much time. So needless to say, I've been working on this since March and I'm just now casting off everything with it. Well, mostly everything. You'll see I have some stitch markers over to this side and I'm going to explain those in a bit. So the Mountain Forger Shrug, it's a completely uh, knitted pattern. I use a little bit of crochet in here, but that's mostly uh, to connect the collar in here, which I find gives it a nice kind of eclectic classic knit look um, but you when I release the pattern or more then welcome to use a darning needle I just like using crochet hooks for certain projects so I just I love how it turned out okay so I I really liked the suggestion the request because also I like working in my yard slash garden I started gardening again over the pandemic and so I had never really thought to make a garment for that per se. I just get out there and I do it. So when this was asked of me, I was like, oh, cool. So I designed it and of course it includes a cable because I'm a cable fanatic if you don't know. By now, your girl just loves to cable. So this is this was a really fun project for me. So I'm not going to like go into too many details on the stitches that I used. To compile this pattern, you'll see soon enough in the free version of this pattern. But also, also I'll be releasing a paid version of this um, project. Right now, it's in the free mode. So when you craft this pattern, this is what it'll look like um, from the free pattern. And then the paid pattern will include instructions on... Uh, on how to do the pocket so at this stage I have not um, stitched the pocket on this is going to be the next phase of my project but here you can see I already have the stitch markers in kind of about where I want to have the pocket going and it's going to run right along the seam of my collar that I attached to be a crochet so that's going to be super fun I look forward to creating that part and also the paid version at this point I'm think I thought about doing sleeves but I think not I think in the paid version I will just um, include my maker notes so like the little tips and tricks Something I didn't account for with this version of the shrug is the fact that I have a larger bust. So when I wear this, this part does not come around on me. And matter of fact, this mannequin is about my size here. So um, yeah, you can see your girl is struggling here. So if I were to have done anything differently from this would be, um, I would have come out maybe about an inch and a half on either side and then did the uh, collar slash thing because it goes all the way around the pattern and then I might have been able to get a little bit more coverage in here and in here but otherwise I love how this turned out and I look forward to sharing more with you guys in the future this pattern will be released in September so stay tuned guys and until then happy making